All right, we're gonna make a pickled cabbage with a purple cabbage here. And uh, I've cut the head in half and then in thirds, and I'm gonna put it in the food processor and uh, then we'll put it in a mixing bowl and mix everything up. All right, so we have all the cabbage chopped up. Did some of it with a knife by hand, did some of it with a food processor. So there's a bunch of different sizes of uh, pieces of cabbage in there. Okay, so we got the one small head of purple cabbage all chopped up. This will be the rest of the ingredients. Um, fairly simple. So we're gonna use the juice of seven limes. We're gonna use two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. We're gonna use one and a half of Himalayan salt or sea salt uh, tablespoons, one tablespoon of black ground pepper, and then red pepper flakes to taste. And all you're gonna do is mix all this stuff together and then you're gonna put it in uh, some type of a container. I like to use a glass jar with a lid. And uh, then you'll let it sit. I, I would let it sit out for a minimum of 30 minutes on the counter or a couple hours in the fridge before you taste it. All right, this is what it looks like with all the ingredients mixed together. And it will um, compact, it, it'll fall in size because um, some of y'all may or may not know this, but the citric acid inside the lime will actually cook this cabbage a little bit. So it will shrink in size a little bit, but uh, we're gonna bottle this up and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, that's what she looks like when she's done. It tastes great. I will say I had a little bit larger than a small head. Um, I, I would say mine was a medium head of cabbage. So I put four tablespoons of olive oil. I put two tablespoons of salt, two tablespoons of pepper, or I'm sorry, one and a half tablespoons of pepper and I added a couple extra limes. Went a little crazy with the red pepper flakes, but I love spicy and it just come out perfect. So this was inspired by Fit Men Cook. Um, the original recipe I gave you is the exact recipe uh, from him. All we did is uh, expand it and made a little bit more, but that's what it come out looking like. And like I say, it tastes really good. So you should definitely give it a try.